Good day, boys and girls. Welcome back to Mr. Pui's English class. Today, we are going to learn about shapes. Today's wheels are, I can say the shapes correctly, and also, I can choose the correct answer. Today, Mr. Pui is going to introduce you one new toy, and the toy is Tangram. Repeat after me, Tangram. Very good. So, this Tangram is actually a toy which made up of different shapes, and we can use these shapes to make into something else. For example, like this. From the Tangram, we can make into something. Can you tell what is this? Correct, it's actually a cat. Isn't it fun? Great! Today, we are going to learn about the different shapes in Tangram. Are you ready? Let's start! So this is a Tangram. The first shape that we are going to learn is Triangle Repeat after me, triangle. The triangle has this T-R-I, tri, which means three. In triangle, we have three sides. One, two, three. That's why it's called a triangle. Read after me, triangle. Very good. The second shape that we are going to learn is square. Repeat after me, square, square. Square has four sides. One, two, three, four. And these four sides are equal, which means they are the same. Square. Repeat after me. Square. Very good. The third shape that we are going to learn is parallelogram. Parallelogram. Repeat after me. Parallelogram. Parallelogram. So if we read faster, it becomes parallelogram. Parallelogram. This parallelogram has four sides. One, two, three, four. Besides the shape in Tangram, we also learn about other shapes. One of it is rectangle. Rectangle. Repeat after me. Rectangle. Very good. Rectangle also has four sides. We have one, two, three, and four. But rectangle has only two sides that are similar in length. That means this and this are the same, and this and this are the same. That's why it's called rectangle. The next shape that we are going to learn is circle. Circle. Repeat after me. Circle. Very good. So this is a circle. Circle has no sides. Now, we have already known the five different shapes that we have learned. Now, we are going to take a look at this toy train. Can you count for me how many shapes are there? Let's start with the triangle. Can you count how many triangle are there? Ready? How many? One? Are you sure? Let's check the answer. 
correct. There's only one triangle. What about square? How many squares are they? Make sure that the four sides are the same. Ready? How many squares are there? Two, three, four. Let's check. Three. Let's see. One, two, and three. Very good. Now, let's take a look at another shape. How many parallelograms are there? Two only? Are you sure? Let's see. Correct! We have one and two. Very good. Let's take a look at the next shape. Rectangle. How many rectangles are there? I can see a lot. Can you count for me? Are you ready? All right, let's see the answer. Ten. Wow, ten. Can we count together? One, two, three, four, six, eight, nine. 10. Correct. There are 10 rectangles all together. Very good. Now, the last one would be circle. How many circles are there? Can you count for me? All right, I'll give you some time. Are you done? All right, let's check the answer. 21. Wow! Let's count together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. 20 and 21. Very good. We have 21 circles here. Good job, everyone. All right, boys and girls, that's all for today. Thank you for joining me at Mr. Pui's English class. See you again. If you like Mr. Pui's English class video, please click like here and also click on the subscribe button. Bye.